center in Dubai that can do a new card, it still shows RT-PCR or antigen test results. So, we asked the Bureau of Quarantine today whether PCR test is still accepted. I asked, pwede po bang RT-PCR test, uh, RT test instead of antigen? Um, Bureau of Quarantine immediately replied, yes, PCR test is still accepted as long as it is taken within 48 hours prior to departure. So, there you go, guys. Unvaccinated, partially vaccinated, 15 years old and above. You still have two options, RT-PCR taken within 48 hours or a rapid antigen test taken within 24 hours before departure. And remember, if you fail to get tested before your trip, there is testing upon arrival, antigen test for 600 to 1,000 pesos. Philippine peso. Again, for testing and vaccinated, you still have two options, RTPC or antigen. But if you don't want to get tested before your trip, you can get tested upon arrival. Meanwhile, in e-arrival card, I just want to share that you are not required to upload a copy of your negative test result. You, they will just ask whether you have a negative test result. So let me show you. Ayan. They will just ask, do you have do you have a negative RT-PCR antigen test result? Just answer yes or no. Okay. While for the fully vaccinated, for the fully vaccinated, the test result question is gone. Remember, I posted about it uh, the other day. So if you're fully vaccinated, guys, so you input your first dose, right? And then you next question is vaccinated for second dose. You say yes, and then input the date and brand. They will no longer ask you about tests, okay? If you're fully vaccinated, you have your vaccine information, they will not ask about test results anymore. Okay, that is clear because before they still had that question. So good thing that BOQ immediately responded. Okay. Meanwhile, guys, Philippine Airlines issued a reminder for travelers that e-arrival card is required. Okay? There have been misinterpretations. No, may mga kababayang nalilito. Akala nila hindi na talaga kailangan ng e-arrival card. Guys, e-arrival card is still a must. So please register within 3 days before your flight to the Philippines. Huwag din ang masyadong i-complicate yung isip niyo 72 hours. Oh, ah, ilang hours. Huwag na. Just think about it. 3 days bago ang inyong flight mag-register. So, 2 days or 1 day or on the day, pwede na. Flexible naman. Huwag na kayong mag- huwag na i-complicate yung hours. Kasi malilito lang kayo. Just focus on 3 days ba or 2 days bago ang flight, pwede na mag-register. Okay? It's, they're not so strict. You can still register. Try okay, bye bye guys. And don't forget to subscribe below and thumbs up to so, our channel and check out our Bibs Closet in its EB and Mikari. And also check out our video will be for an each and EB. Bye bye guys and see you to the next video. God bless you all. Bye.